So let's test low GI rice on my CGM today. It says on the packaging that this rice is good for the entire family. It's recommended by world's leading diabetic association. GI is below 55 and it helps manage sugar level and weight. It doesn't mention anything about the macronutrient content or why it's low GI. So I'm quite skeptical, but I'm willing to give it a try. I'm going to have exactly 60 grams of this rice that were cooked in one spoon ghee with 150 grams of chicken to find out what it does to my blood sugar levels. All right, it's been a couple of hours, so let's have a look at my CGM. As you can see here, my blood sugar has spiked by 70 points after I had low GI rice. This is extremely disappointing because I tried my best to balance this meal by adding some fats and protein. One thing is for sure that if you keep eating these rice, there is a pretty good chance that you will become diabetic over time. I later found out that in 2019, Consumer Complaint Council found the claims made by this product as misleading by omission. Feel free to share this with others and keep in mind that your individual results will always vary.